go. Hi friends, we have another letter investigation here. I just want to remind you that I'm having a lot of fun doing this investigation and I know you're having fun watching too, but it would be fun for you to set one up at your house just like this when you're all done watching. So let's see how this one goes. Oh, I have all these different Lego vehicles that somebody built. Oh, let's see what we have. We have some police cars and we have motorcycle and a pizza truck, some other vehicles. But all of these vehicles have some letters added to them. Let's take a look at what letters we see. Hmm, well, here we have an, oh, what is it? Oh, you're right, it is an O. And here we have an N. And here we have an S. You could say these at home with me. And here we have another S. And here we have an M. Oop, add that back on. And here we have a P. And what's this one? It's such a cute little I, one of my favorite letters. Well, all of these letters, when we put them together, they might make a word or maybe a name. So right now we're gonna try to match all of these cars to their right parking space. And their parking space is a space that has the letter that is on the front of their car and on their parking space. So let's see how this goes. Oh, let's start with my favorite little letter I. So we're gonna drive it over and it's gonna look for its right parking space and it matches I and I. Oh, let's see. Oh, here's a little one, this little P. We're gonna drive it over to its right spot. Oh, it matches P and P. this little M. You're gonna drive it over to its spot and park it. We have an S. We're gonna drive it over and park it. Oh, we have another S. We're gonna drive it over to its spot. Oh, this is hard work matching all these letters. I wonder if they are gonna spell something that we know. Hmm. Oop, the motorcycle has an N. Oh, we're gonna drive it over and park it. We have one left. Oop. Oop, here's the little O. We're gonna drive the old car over to its parking space. Oh, and then when I look at all the letters together, when I look at the S and the I and the M and the P and the S and the O and the N, I know that they spell something I know that I remember from school in our message every day. This is part of Mrs. Simpson's name. It spells Simpson. Oh. Well, you could set this up at your house too. You could find little cars at your house and you could put the letters in your name or your last name or another word. Put the letters on all the cars with a little bit of tape and then you could make parking spaces for them too. How fun would that be? You should give it a try. Thanks.